Has anyone else noticed that when an adult child chooses to not have a relationship with a parent, it's always, but she's your mom. And I'm gonna trauma dump here a little bit, so buckle up. I didn't talk to my father the last 10 years of his life, and when he died, I didn't go to his funeral. And I had many family members reach out to me privately and talk about how disappointing it was, about how much I am the one that was harming the family by not showing up, by me not showing up to a service to listen to a bunch of people talking about how great this person was when we damn well all knew he wasn't. But I was the one that was harming the family. I was the bad person because my not being there was an indictment of everybody else for not doing shit when he was alive. Nobody seemed to have anything to say when he was destroying his life and making sure my childhood was filled with chaos and fear. If there's one thing a family hates more than an abuser, it's a truth teller. And when an adult child chooses to go no contact with that parent, that is a very loud truth.